Kenya Breweries Limited is warning of a rise in the consumption of illegal brews due to the rising alcohol taxation in the country. The giant brewer further says the implementation of the inflation adjustment taxes by the Kenya Revenue Authority will result in reduced government revenues, losses to farmers, distributors and loss of jobs. The brewer says barley and sorghum based beer sales have declined by 21% and 32% respectively for the period of July and August this year. In July 2022, Parliament passed Finance Act 2022, which increased the excise rates for beer and spirits by 10% and 20% respectively. The Kenya Breweries Limited says as a result, barley and sorghum-based beer sales have declined by 21% and 32% respectively for the period of July and August 2022, levels that were last observed in the same period last year when the alcohol industry was under COVID-19 restrictions. The high prices of alcohol have encouraged the growth of illicit brews and the proliferation of cheap raw spirits from neighboring countries. The brewer notes that the excise tax increase effected in July 2022 has had the same impact with performance mirroring the same period last year when COVID-19 restrictions were in effect. KBL is urging KRA to halt increasing the current excise tax rates for the financial year 2022-2023. KBL says another increase in taxes will lead to a loss of 588 million shillings in income to farmers and over 15,000 farmers will be affected by reduced uptake of sorghum and barley grain for production. In addition, finished goods distribution and retail trade will lose 4.2 billion shillings in a reduction in raw material use, 15.7 billion shillings in employment income loss, and 35,364 people will lose their jobs. Reporting for Prime Edition, I am Teresa Mutai.